doing the foliage today the freeform foliage you're gonna make it on today yeah I was gonna go down earlier but you know I have so much to do and then do I want to keep the white outlines didn't I want to do that last time I'm not gonna do it this time um I have a lot of stuff to do and the whole ADHD which one do I do first thing really slows me down when it comes to actually doing anything so I've kind of been battling with that all day I will get myself back on my normal schedule eventually but right now uh, kind of slack it This is so satisfying. It's so pretty. <clears throat> What's everyone up to today? was able to get the um, the mystery box with the new releases in it. Last I checked there were like four left. So most of them are gone, but there's a couple left. a sale going on right now. It is 10% um, off site wide, I believe, with code alpha. So you can use that. I don't know if it's glitter or site wide. I think it's site wide. <clears throat> You'd have to read the top of the website. I'm overwhelmed with information, so I might be getting that wrong. But the code is alpha. <laughs> it expires Tuesday. You sell out of your bundle. Um, not that I'm aware of. I think last time I checked, there were still four left. Um, and it's a bundle of the new colors. There's 20 of them that you can't buy individually right now. Right now, they are only in the bundle. Um, but that is linked on the homepage if there's still any more.
it's so satisfying to peel it away. Has anyone done this template yet? Anyone in here anyway? I know some people have done it. It was our contest template um, the month before last. Joey, hello. You snag your baby already? Or are you still waiting on him? template. The template is um, called Freeform Foliage and it's on my website on coldglitter.com. And there is a code on top of the website, code alpha, if you want to save a little bit off of the, the template. If you find that you like a lot of templates on the website, uh, look into the all access pass. It's a one time thing and it's a lifetime pass. It'll give you access to all the digitals. You'll get, you'll get new designs a week early and I release new stuff every week. Making sure I'm not missing anything. <clears throat> Jess, hello. Missed you feeling like a stalker over here. <laughs> yeah, I've been really busy. I've been trying to juggle a lot of shit at the same time. But I'm trying to get back on my schedule now. I am late today, but at least I'm here. <laughs> if she's with a seam, it's going to strip it. I you know I even did a rough job on my seam today, too, but I'll fix it. Well, if I left the outline, I could have fixed it. I don't know where you put it. <clears throat> Good afternoon or morning. Hello. Sent you a chat. Um, on the website, I'll check it. I don't get notified of it when I'm live, but I'll check it when I get off. Worth every penny. Yes, the access pass is twin. What's up, twin? Oh my god, make it a mess. <clears throat> so I'm gonna go in with death. Oh, y'all. Restocks are in. Okay, all of the restocks. Um, I just got customs updated Friday. All the customs are now live. So those of you who are waiting on Black Magic and Aquarius and Andromeda and Tombstone and all that stuff's back up. All of it's back. And then there are um, some new colors that are being released. They are not released yet. But I do have a mystery bundle with all 20 of the new colors available on the homepage of my website. And I think there's only three left. It looks like I just got an order for one of them. Um, so there is a black and white photo of the colors that you'll be receiving for the listing, but I'm not showing the colors yet. So that is a mystery bundle. But they will be released um, eventually. I'm not sure exactly the date yet. Love this template. Thank you. I loved this one. I was drawing it and I wasn't really sure if I liked it at first. And then um, I have a group chat with a few of y'all and I was sending it, like asking opinions. And taking the feedback, I made it into something that I did like and now I'm obsessed with it. <laughs> I do not sell pre cuts, no. I do not have, um, it would take me way too long. I'd have to have a million machines going to keep up with that demand. I just don't have the resources to be able to do it. Definitely not the time. <clears throat> Any new templates? I did not. I was supposed to put out a template last week, but I didn't because there was too much going on. So I did skip last week, both the template and the color palette. Um, but I will have a new template coming out tomorrow. It'll be available for the all access um, and it will go public to everyone else 
the following Tuesday because All Access gets the new ones a week in advance. Or space, or space. Do not have space, that's for sure. <laughs> Is there anyone in here who does pre-cut templates? So here's the thing. If you guys want to offer my templates pre-cut, let me know because I get questions a lot of people ask me for that and I don't offer it. But if that's something that you do offer, I could send people to you to buy them. Um, I just don't have the ability to do it myself. <clears throat> Amanda. What's up, woman? Best investment ever done is the all access. Yes, it's a great freaking deal. I mean, I don't even know how many templates you gotta buy. Like, you buy like, I don't know, 15 templates and you're already buying the past. <clears throat> it's like almost four grand worth of templates on the website as it is, and you're getting them all for a hundred bucks plus the new ones. Where is my vacuum? <laughs> <clears throat> Jess, I was supposed to put together some kind of like reference sheet like we were talking about earlier and I didn't. I was everywhere except where I was supposed to be. <laughs> so I need to, I'll still chat with you later, but I didn't put that sheet together like I was planned on doing. Um, I do not know what colors I'm doing with this. I did not plan that out. Um, I am feeling deep fuchsia, magenta, burgundy, purple, something like that. Purple? <laughs> All right, let's go purple. How about poisonberry? Poisonberry is back and it's really pretty. Um, where is it? It's a very deep, bold purple. I like that one. And this one is poison berry. And maybe pair this with velvet. Purples, peaks, purples. Missed everything you said about the pre-cut templates. Oh, if anybody wants to offer my templates pre-cut, let me know. Because um, when people ask me for them, I can send them to y'all. Because I cannot offer them pre-cut. But I understand some people don't have the machine for it. <clears throat> so if anybody does that or wants to do that, let me know. <clears throat> Even if it's several of y'all, I'll put together a list and put it in my bio so people have easy access to it. You? Okay. Do you have anything available for that already? Like, linked in your stuff or anywhere? Maybe not. Because <laughs> if I can, if you want to do it, I just need to know where to link them to. And, um some people over there. Seance is back, y'all. Seance is so pretty. That one's back. I'm so glad to have all my restocks back in. Now I'm not so limited with my color palette. I think I'm gonna go with Casaloma though. Kelsey! What's up, woman? No, but I can. If you want to. I mean, if you don't want to do it, don't. But if you do want to, let me know and then I'll, um, I'll get you linked somewhere so I'll send people your way. All right, so I think I'm gonna ombre these leaves, these two, and then I'll figure out my background later. So you know we gotta ombre. This is, no, these are um, ultra fines. So these are 128th of an inch or 0.2 millimeters, depending on uh, what you use for your glitters. <clears throat> we buy the template from you and then them or what? No, if they sell them pre-cut, you would just buy the pre-cut from them. They would have the template. Lime green. <clears throat> so if I did, should I ombre each leaf pink to purple? Or should I ombre each stem pink to purple? I kind of want to do each stem, but I would want a third color to break up this. Like crinkles? MIA have been up my own ass with planning my elopement and oh yeah. 
How's that going? This is what I'm doing. I'm doing these three and they're very pretty and I like them. Light pink for the third color. What if I do light for the background and dark on the leaves? Pink to purple on the leaves. I'm confused. Yes, yeah that. Oh, light background, dark leaves. Okay, gotcha, I follow. <clears throat> I wanna switch this though. thinking. I'm thinking I want to be complicated. <laughs> I'm thinking I want to be complicated. So what's in my head right now is do the shadow, like the base of the leaves, purple, all of them. But then ombre the two pinks for the tips of the leaves. Does that make sense? Do you sell the glitters? I do, yes. And I just restocked um, almost everything. There's very few that are still out of stock. Um, and that's just because they sold out when my restock was coming in. But I do. Everything is in stock. Um, if anybody in here has an affiliate code and you want to post an affiliate code, um, you can. That'll give you 15% off. You can be supporting somebody, too. <clears throat> do you ship to the UK? I do ship to the UK, yes. Really light pink background? I can do that. I have a really light pink that glows. Oh, but my background is black. My tape is black. I don't know how that'll work. You sell out the mystery boxes? I don't think so. I think there's three left. I didn't check. I think I looked this morning. And there were four, but I did just sell one of them. Um, I'm going to experiment, I think. I need another paper for these. I don't want to go back and forth with the... Thing this whole time. <clears throat> I have to rearrange my desk. I'll give me a second. <laughs> okay. If I don't keep my desk clean, I will lose my fucking mind. I use the order the mystery box. Um, if you message me. Um, email me as Chris with a K at coltlitter.com um, and give me your order number and let me know. I'll, I'll help refund that difference for you. I was saying, you know, <laughs> no, definitely not at all. It used to be really bad, but not nearly as bad as um, I was. I have learned to use it to help me for the most part now. <laughs> kind of going everywhere. I should have just worked at a single part of the stem and not this whole thing. Poor planning on my part. I am going to try and do shadow base on each individual leaf and then ombre the top of the leaves with these two pinks. So with pink and purple. Let's see what happens. Which means I'm going to need a smaller brush. Um, brushes, y'all. The brushes, I am low on my stock of these. I have to do order some more. So if y'all want the brushes, um, snag some way you can because I don't have that many left. <clears throat> tape, I got plenty of tape and all the glitter just got restocked. So I should be good on that stuff. But the brushes, I am pretty low on right now. to do if my dumbass didn't just pull the whole thing because so now we got to do this and try not to get it everywhere not smart not smart if 
few leaves at a time next time. <laughs> it's kind of hard to do that though if I have to ombre the whole stem. I don't know. And these guys I have to read too, which I forgot about. Is this one of your templates? Yes, this one is called Freeform Foliage. This one is linked on the website. Oh shit, I'm not wearing my apron either. I'm gonna be sparkly when I get off here. Okay. I'm making me a cup of these colors. <laughs> You want a cup of these colors? I still have to use the remainder of my gift card. Oh yeah. <clears throat> There's a couple people in there with gift cards that they ain't finished yet. All right, so I don't know if I'm gonna like this method of, I feel like I need to ombre with three colors though. Keep the bases purple and then ombre with three because just two. It's not going to do it for me. Uh, velvet for more. If I use a different... No. Where will I go with this? Do I want to do purple? That one, I'm not really going to see anything. Which will ask me if I buy a cup here, get your package. Uh, no, I don't think I did. Unless it was delivered in my mailbox. Sometimes they do that and I don't check that often. <laughs> Does it show it was delivered? Your brushes are sold out now. Oh, they shouldn't be. Hold on. Let me fix that real quick. They are sold out. Hold on. Give me one second. Count them and see how many I have. I just updated that. <clears throat> it is fixed. Busy all weekend, so I haven't checked. <clears throat> I had one thing delivered to me, but it's a um, cup that I made for someone a couple years ago. And um, they had a problem around the rim, so I'm going to clean it up and reseal it for them. Kiss of Death, final warning. That one? We're gonna go with that one. We're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. No, we're not. We're gonna. Nah, fuck it. We'll keep it. Okay. Now I know what I'm doing. Kinda. So I checked Sezzle when you dropped the box. 163. Use a code. I still have, is it not showing any box out there? I use it to buy the new turner, so it's been, oh. <laughs> It'll drop below that. I think. I don't know. <clears throat> All right, so. This is so pretty. I was thinking about trying MH. Um, I don't know, I gotta do my research on my turners and just throw in a name that I know out there, but that's one I was thinking about it. But I need a black, y'all know me, it's gonna be black. Can't have no white turners in here.
Jess, I know you're into your neons, but I think you're gonna like this one. I just kind of like the way the colors are going together. These turners. I had a mask for a turners right now, but they don't even make turners anymore. They have some kind of weird ass sewing crochet yarn something or another thing that they sell now, and that's it. Nothing else. A second you put it on the table. <laughs> This light is so difficult to like, I gotta be careful what angle I'm at today because I got stuff on my desk. It is so pretty. I like it. I want that purple. Which one? I'm using four. These are the four that I'm using today. I just have that one I thrown off to the sides. It was my base. <clears throat> Who's Turners? Um, the Maspro Turners. M A S B R O S. Maspro's Turners. But they don't make Turners no more. They said, fuck you guys. And don't do it. <laughs> the last one on the right. This one, this is Poisonberry. I love it because there's such a vibrancy to this one that the other ones don't have. Like Grave Bells has it, but Grave Bells isn't purple. <laughs> it's the same vibrancy that this has, same vibrancy that Cauldron, Cauldron, um, Cauldron Boil that has the same level of vibrancy, but it's a really bright blue, like a cobalt blue. Grave Bells, Poisonberry, and Cauldron Boil would all be beautiful together. Three different brands I wouldn't do again, but I love the other two companies. One I wouldn't do again. Are they like notable Tumblr ones or? Because the only Tumblr companies I know of are Dino's and MH. I have no experience with either of them. I'm honestly kind of thinking about just building my own. The only reason I wouldn't is just I'm not great at like leveling Shit, I'm so fucking OCD. And then I overthink. Why am I throwing my pieces over here? I overthink so damn much and you think that'd be a good thing, but it overcomplicates it and then I fuck it up. <laughs> I don't know. I used to build all my turners, but that was a long time ago. And they were heavy because I didn't have two by fours, which is dumb. You can do it on melamine. <clears throat> Wrong paper, yes. <laughs> Bama is the best. Oh, is that a Tumblr thing? Because I have a problem in here with like, um, I have a lot of animals and like pet hair and like lint and you know, bullshit gets stuck in my uh, epoxy once in a while and I really need to dust in here and I probably solved that problem, but um, <clears throat> I want one with a cover on it. Rather than having to buy covers for my cups, I'd rather have a cover over the whole thing like you do, Kelsey. Oh, yours are being okay. Tumblr Grip is great to work with. Tumblr Grip is one I love, as well as Grateful Glitters. Oh, yeah. See, I didn't know Grateful Glitters had turners until Molly's. Tammy, hello. How you doing? Are there any boxes left? I should probably find out. I wish I could program the website to work with the, the G word over here. She'll answer me if I say her name. Cause then I can just ask her. I wonder if I can get my phone assistant S word person to sync with Shopify to where I could ask her about inventory levels if she could answer me. I wonder if I can make an automation for that. That would be badass. Okay. Kelsey, 
Kelsey Orner from? And I was like, no. Oh, I don't remember who that was, but I remember the situation. I'm on it. Thank you, ma'am. Um, okay. Let's go with this beautiful purple. What colors are you using? I am using... <laughs> Jess, your technical mind's like, what? What can I do? <laughs> um, poison berry and velvet. And Casaloma and Grey Bells. I do not have many of Grey Bells because Grey Bells was not included in the restock. I think I have like nine of these left maybe. Um, and then they're going to be sold out. <laughs> Which is one of my favorite colors. I didn't realize it was that low. I would have ordered them. But it probably wasn't that low. I probably got that low during the when I was reading on the restock. But I do plan on ordering a small restock here soon. Two left. Okay, awesome. So, you guys, I have new glitters that are releasing. I do not know when they will be release, releasing individually, but. Right now, I have them available in a mystery box on my website. There's 20 of them in the box. There are 19 ultra finds and one chunky, and there's only two of those boxes left. There is a photo on the listing, but the photo is black and white. <laughs> so you can't see the colors, which is the mystery box, but it does show you the names of everything. <clears throat> so if y'all want that, I got two left. They'll be packed today and they will be picked up in the morning. makes your turners in black. Ooh. Do they have a cover on there? On their turners? Because I desperately need that. If I'm going to invest in somebody to make me one, I want to make sure it's black. <laughs> and, have a, and has a cover. I think I need to tease them with the glitter that I chose. <laughs> what colors are you using? Um, I am using... Hold on. Poison Berry and Velvet. And then Casaloma and Grey Bells. And then I use Death for my outline. Um, okay. I will tease y'all with Kelsey. So Kelsey literally fought for me to buy this glitter. This is Kelsey's glitter. This is one of the new ones. This is the only chunky that's being released right now. The only new release. But this is Kelsey's glitter. It's called Chaos Hex. It's so pretty. And that's it. <laughs> Only two left, yes. Okay, so if you like this chunky, I need to tell you something because the chunkies don't, I don't buy as many chunkies because they don't sell as well. I'm known for templates, my finds are what sell. If all of these boxes sell, all of these chunkies are gone. So I'm gonna have to wait till I get a restock order to get this in. So while all of them will be released individually, this one, once these boxes sell out, will not be in stock until they get more in. <clears throat> I didn't plan ahead and order as many as I should have. <clears throat> I forfeited one for y'all, so y'all <laughs> Yes. Kelsey wanted two and she's like, no, I'm only gonna get one. So we can have more boxes available. She did do that. What box? Um, it is a mystery box of the 20 new glitters. So on the homepage of my website, it gives you a black and white photo of all the new stuff, but it does not show you the actual colors. This is so gorgeous.
Oh, and I do have, um, <clears throat> let's see, the vinyl stencils. These are digitals um, on my website under digital downloads. This one's called Freeform Foliage. Give me one second, y'all. <laughs> um, okay, let me work with a small thing because then I can know what the hell I'm doing. I do have so listen if y'all are not on the email um at the bottom of my website you can sign up for the email if you're not getting them already I only have one email go out a week it's Friday mornings um but I do have something new coming soon and I'm one of the reasons I haven't been active is because I've been working on getting that going and um I have a fun way that I'm going to announce that so it will be announced in the email sort of. It's complicated. But sign up for the email. <laughs> I won't blow you up, I promise. Once a week. That's all. Sure, so I can cry in my coffee. <laughs> they will be released, Amanda. I am going to work on a restock just so I can get those chunkies back in. Kelsey's chunky mix. She literally fought for that, y'all, for real. She's like, even if you don't put it on the website, you better order me a whole bag. <laughs> Yeah, the new thing is exciting. There are very few people who know about the new thing. But, um... I'm working on it. Almost everything is in place to release it. I'm working on it. Man, I love these colors. I'm kind of disappointed that the phone doesn't, like... Oh, that's better. Now you can see it. Look how beautiful that is. Get a monthly subscription going and I'll be your employee. <laughs> Something I'll don't. I know. I do. Guilty. I'm excited. I can't wait to launch it. What type of paper I'm getting excited? Earth Mommy here does not do well with computers. This is um, template tape. This is linked in my bio, um, or you can search it on my website. It's basically a giant double-sided piece of clear tape. You just cut your design into the front of it. I'm trying to figure out a Garrett's case to tell my husband why I need him to cash out me funds. <laughs> um, you need a new tire. <laughs> tell him you need half a new tire just to fuck with him. <laughs> I'm excited for you and I'm clueless. I think you'll enjoy it. I think you'll enjoy it. I love your glitter. Molly has created a monster. <laughs> well, thank you. Molly is, um, yeah, Molly's freaking awesome. I think I talk to her almost every day. <clears throat> I'm getting excited. Thank you. 
<laughs> You're welcome. A video list that she teaches you how to apply. Yes, I do. So on my TikTok, um, I do have a video pinned showing you how to apply this to your cup. But in my bio, I do have a, um, a complete start to finish tutorial. It's a template tumbler how-to guide on how to do this. And it starts with working your digital into Cricut um, and it ends with epoxy. So it goes over the whole thing. And it links all the supplies too. Well worth the wait. It has been a long time coming. I tried to release it a year ago and I hit a roadblock. I tried to release it at the beginning of this year, hit another roadblock. And then I said, fuck it, and um, took the risk and released it probably sooner than I should have. Um, if I should, was it, well, I feel like if I was adulting correctly, I would have waited. But you know what? I waited long enough and I deserved it. So <laughs> I said, fuck it. And I did it. So now you guys get to read the benefits of it soon. <laughs> I'm excited for her to get it. I did get it, Amanda. I do have it. It's in-house. I'm just learning some stuff about it and figuring out the logistics of everything before I launch it. But it is here. <laughs> YOLO, yes. If that's what it was, Joey, I still couldn't tell you. <laughs> it's a cold glitter pony, you guys. <laughs> Where the fuck would I put a pony? <laughs> I have questions. So go for it. The anticipation. I'm hoping to announce this new thing by the end of the month, but the way I'm launching it, um, it's still going to be a bit of a mystery, but it will be put out there by the end of the month. It will be available for you to purchase before the end of the month. By the end of the month, I go, I, my goal is that anyway. That's what I'm pushing for because that was my original plan. I'm a little behind on that plan, but that's my plan. <laughs> my first clip glitter is so much glitter, I obviously need more. <laughs> well, thank you and welcome to the chaos. <laughs> it's fun here. <laughs> This one is the top, so it's gonna be pink. Fall foliage, freeform foliage. Very close. I love chaos. Me too. It's respectful chaos. It's not like lose your fucking shit chaos. It's fun chaos. We like this kind of chaos. <laughs> Let me see. 
Um, give me one second, y'all. to send money and ask him where he's at he'll know I wasn't listening to him both times <laughs> he funds your habit <laughs> that's funny I'd ask for something fucking stupid just so he like <clears throat> he knows you're full of shit you know what I mean <laughs> I need this much money to buy a cow. Like, you know, something dumb. He's like, what do you want more glitter? <laughs> I'm doing a hearing test with him. He'll probably get a 90. <laughs> Great. Girl, I didn't even recognize you. You had your, your icon changed. I didn't realize you popped in here. I see that little blue circle. I didn't realize it was you. My best sales weekend, I guess I could borrow from my business. Oh shit, there you go. Feel you. Good sales are a good day. I should have recognized it because it was on your business card that you sent me yesterday or this morning or whenever the fuck we were talking. I don't remember. <clears throat> Until I actually read the name, I didn't recognize it was you. Uh, where's my tiny one? There you go. you on purpose next time now you're expecting it <laughs> I don't know. you know I was thinking too Brie last night when I was talking about that red paint you know how mm, how heavy that one thing is and I can't name like it's gonna be really fucking hard to like paint there now because then I gotta move it I wasn't thinking about that shit. I should have painted it before all of that. Paint around it. <laughs> Leave a giant red square. <laughs> Girl, my OCD is not gonna survive. <laughs> Sorry, I was epoxy. I can't handle all these mysteries. My heart. Ugh, it's gonna be fun. Look. I can't, I can't, I want to say something to help y'all, but I can't. All I can do, I am working, let me say this, on delegating some of the shit that keeps me from moving forward a lot of times to free me up to make stuff like this easier and faster to launch. Um, so I am working on that. But, uh, Hopefully I can get some free time here soon and I can speed up this process. All access. I feel like I'm stealing <laughs> with the pass. <laughs> hey, use and abuse the pass. It likes it. <laughs> 
When can we talk about the mystery colors? After we get them in the mail? Yeah, if, and do you get them? They're yours. Post the videos, do what you want. I just, I'm not announcing them. Basically, this is you guys announcing the new colors. The way this is working out. I'm not listing them. They're probably not going to be listed on the website until after you guys receive them. So you guys will be the ones announcing the new colors, essentially. I'm not really you. She's, she is. Bree, I mean, number one, she mods for fucking everybody, and she's great at it. <laughs> Man, this is so beautiful. Look at this. It's got to be out of focus, because if I do this, it just darkens. But if I go out of focus a little bit, you can see the colors, and it's so pretty. <clears throat> So you're delegating it to us. <laughs> See, there we go. <laughs> yeah, so if you have the all access pass, um, I'm, I'm trying to think of some more perks to give to the pass, the pass people. Um, I haven't really figured out details on that, but it is something that I do want to do. Um, but for right now, all access pass, not only do you get the free downloads for life, but um, <clears throat> you, you get the new stuff a week before everybody else. New digital this week before everybody else. <laughs> Start charging for yourself. You should. Shit, make a name for yourself. Side gig. Another side gig. <laughs> crazy that turned into a thing. Molly can pay me in blanks and Chris can pay me in glitter. <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> Maybe addicted. Hard line to your soul, promise. <laughs> That's true, Amanda, because I remember we were on live the other day and we we're like, wait, you do this too? You do these too? Like, where'd this come from? Yeah, I, I thought you just did templates. Well, cups in general, but templates. We need to talk. Girl, blow me up. I can't, I'm not going to get any messages right now, but blow me up. I'll check when I get off. Or we'll talk later because I got to talk to you anyway. Site wide. Okay, so I'm not fucking nuts. I couldn't remember if it was site wide or just glitter. Wait, which way does this one? For some reason, when I drew this leaf, I connected it on both sides. I don't know why I did that. That was dumb. But it confuses me every time I go in here. OG, call it better employee, and nobody's taking my spot. <laughs> Bree, not bro. These templates glitter just being online with you all. Lawyers are fun. I like that. Uh, I think I've only seen one person post in that new live chat to announce your lives, you know? I think I've only seen one person. I was, uh, uh, Kayla, I think. I don't remember who it was. I forgot. Yeah. Well, we can post for each other, too. You don't gotta just post for yourself, but... Hold on a second. Someone just bought a pass. Let me activate that real quick. So you don't have to sit there and wait on it. 
If anybody buys a pass when I'm live, let me know so I can activate it for you. If you have one that you've already purchased today and I didn't catch it, let me know and I will go ahead and activate it. All right, that one is active. <clears throat> it was you. I just activated it, so you're good. You'll probably get an email. It's like, let the chaos begin. <laughs> oh, and guys, I think I found out. I know some of y'all are messaging me saying that you had problems with the past. Like, you only see page one or something. And I'd have to go in and manually tag it to fix it. I think I know what was causing that. There was an update with um, that app that I use to allow the pass to work. And until I went into that app, it wanted me to like accept some the new updates essentially. And I did. So I'm hoping that's the only thing that was causing it. So hopefully we won't have that problem no more. But if you do ever have that problem, let me know. Because I just have to go in and manually tag your account to fix it. And then I'll have to reach out and figure out what the hell's going on. But I'm hoping that's all that was. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Yeah, you know, I still have not got up and put my apron on. <clears throat> Man, I love this. This is so pretty. This fallout is going to be beautiful. Anybody who placed an order that I have not filled yet, <laughs> if it came through today, I haven't filled it. If y'all want this fallout, let me know your order number and I'll put it in a little baggie and throw in your order. <clears throat> what colors are these? These are Casaloma, Grey Bells, Velvet, and Poison Berry. Uh oh. Puzzle piece? Puzzle piece. Glad I was looking at the screen. And then death is my outline. I enjoyed our false fall while it was here and now we're back to heat. <laughs> you are welcome. What do you do for the background? I don't know. We're talking about going light for the background. But you know me and my darkness. Like, <laughs> I don't know, but I don't want to go black so it'll swallow the outline. I don't know. I really like dropping random colors, um, like cohesive colors, but random, dropping them randomly. I don't know if I'm going to do that or not, though. 7362. <laughs> Is that a shippable one? Let's see. Oh, wait, you do have a shippable one. 617361. Okay, hold on. Where's my Sharpie at? I don't know if I can. I don't know my Sharpie is. Hold on. This is not working. Oh, shit. That one shit. Saver fall. I used to do that. I used to, because when you're packing glitter, I used to pack a hell of a lot more glitter than I do now. Now my supplier does it. Um, <clears throat> oh, my Sharpie's in the other room, but that's fine. I can kind of read what this is. 7361, yeah. Um, <clears throat> all the fallout I used to get from packing my glitter, I would save and I would release it once a year on April Fool's. And I would call it Fool's Fuck Ups. Fool's Fuck Ups 1, 2, 3, whatever. But I don't do that no more because I don't have that much fallout. <laughs> Don't need talent, good colors in a cricket. Yep. Yep, yep. Ordered the mystery box, went back and ordered the access pass. <laughs> I'm doing too much today. Dude, that's been my month. I feel you. <laughs> I'm 
I'm like crying every time I spend money right now because um, this new thing that's coming, not only was that pricey, but getting set up and prepared to release it and everything is just spending a whole lot. Join the Facebook group. Yes. Almost everybody here in the chat is in the Facebook group. Wish they lived closer. I would love to help you. Shit, I would take it too. <laughs> I have been fighting to try and get this stuff done. Usually when I'm processing glitter, um, I don't miss a whole week of live or two, three weeks. I don't remember where my stuff came in. I don't miss this much time. But I did this time. I mean, there were several reasons for me missing, but towards the end, it was definitely the restock. How is the glitter sticking to the cup? So what I'm using, um, it's basically a giant sheet of double-sided adhesive. So these little white pieces that I'm peeling up, um, think of it like the back of a sticker, because when I peel it up, it's sticky right there. So I just work based on what section I want to glitter at the moment, and it sticks to whatever I expose. Now the tape itself is clear, but I put black vinyl behind my material, so it shows up black behind there. under a different name on the book of face. Gotcha. I call it fake book. <laughs> I worked on the thorn coffin and this to it today. Ooh. I want to see what you did with it. I like that one a lot. Do that one again. Dude, so much Beetlejuice that one up. Who wants who likes Beetlejuice? Who wants to do the thorn coffin and roses and all Beetlejuice colors? Oh wait. Do I want to do that one? Hmm. No, I don't want to do that one. Hold on. Let me glitter this one right here real quick because I want it to be. I shouldn't have pulled that one. get a raffle ticket in your order keep it tucked away she has a giveaway yes that's you mean it was always confused when you said back of a sticker i get it now oh is this a new one this one is not a new one kelly this is um this was a few weeks ago the free form foliage is this one i was already going to <laughs> redoing hers and that's what i thought beetlejuice you just planning on doing it shit do it Y'all, somebody post in the group about it. Make your own contest. Get everybody doing it. I think it'd be freaking awesome. It's a perfect template for that. Like, who else wants to join the challenge? Beetlejuice, Thorn, Coffin, Challenge, or whatever you want to call it. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry, can you show the colors you're using? Yes. So I'm using... Um, Poisonberry and Velvet, and Casaloma and Grey Bells. And then Death is my outline color. Y'all, I ordered a shit ton of this, so it should not be selling out anytime soon. Because I know it's, it gets out of stock quite a bit, but I have a ton of it. A ton. So hopefully I'll be good for a while. And Kane and Hell's Gates. Okay, hold on. I need to take the opportunity here to show y'all Kane and Hell's Gates because I done fucked up. 
<laughs> when I ordered these glitters and I ordered a shit ton of one. Okay, and Hellgate. So for those of you who do not know how beautiful they are, let me show you to encourage you to buy it and get it out of my house because I have way, way too much. So, Cane and Hell's Gates, this is the same color and fine and chunky. These are literally the most vibrant reds. They are so beautiful and they're actually iridescent. But the cool thing about this red is even though it is iridescent, it will still cover over black and it keeps its vibrancy. It is so beautiful. It literally looks like crushed rubies. And this is the fine version. They are easily my favorite reds. Very easily. It literally looks like crushed ruby. It's like can't even, camera's not doing it justice. If you have it, you know. <laughs> very, very pretty colors. And I have a ton of them, so please get them out of my house. <laughs> I have so much. And it's gorgeous. Yes, it is. And it covers over black. What covers over black? Metallic? Holographic? That's it. Chameleon? Iridescent does not. This does. She saves it and throws it in orders. The fallout? Yes. Um, usually I just toss it, but if I have a color palette like this that's just really pretty, it creates a really pretty mix. So I throw them in little baggies. Um, and if anybody on live wants it, I throw it in their order if they placed an order. You have to use it for pins or whatever you want, you know? <clears throat> Sometime now, one time I was live working on a design and I didn't know what to do for part of the design. They told me like use your fallout for did I miss a piece somewhere? I did. Damn it! I'll fix it later. Um, use your fallout to fill in that part of the template, and that was honestly my favorite part of the whole template was using, for example, all of these colors for different sections, and then using this as a color for another section. So that is something y'all can do. I always forget to do it, but it is really really nice when you do. It matches and just brings everything together. Do I still have that cup? No, I think I sold it recently. I did sell it recently. Oh, and that's another thing. If y'all want cups um, on coltglittertumblers.com, I still have the RTS sale going on. So if you do code ready to ship at checkout, you will um, save 20% off of your order. And if you order two cups, um, you'll get free shipping. Now I do, I don't know if Lori's in here. Lori, your cup is done. I'm sorry, it's been done for a minute and I have not shipped it yet because I've been overwhelmed and kind of forgot about it until yesterday. Um, I will get your cup packed hopefully today and shipped out. And I do have two from Jessica, Jennifer, I don't remember her name. I had to get a final coat on those two and get those shipped out. Um, yes, thank you, Bree. My checkout one forgot I have to post. Hell yeah. <clears throat> Is it neon? <laughs> You're like, duh. Of course it's neon. I love how you use your fallout. Ew, what does she do with fallout? Neon fallout's the best. I need to spend more time in lives. Yesterday I was hopping around lives. Um, Cause somebody posted in the live chat that they were live. So I went in there and I saw a bunch of people live. So I was trying to hop into everybody's live and say, hey. It was late, I should have been sleeping. I was up working and procrastinating both you forgot the post there today yeah it's you know you gotta create a new habit and it's not always easy <laughs> oh three could you show your kids that video and see if they can hear it? <laughs> the one I sent you last night? I'm curious. I'm 
Okay, where's that little piece that I missed here? I already did this black. I'll see if they can. <laughs> Gray Bells is sold out. Um, hold on. Let me look and see. I don't know if um, it sold out after I updated the on hands or if I didn't save the on hands when I updated them. Gray Bells. Available zero. Committed zero. Okay, hold on. Let me see if I still have them over there. I have nine of them. So when I updated the on hands, it just didn't save. Hold on. It is updated. And it downloaded the videos wrong. TikTok, be right back. Okay. Been hopping through today, Ziggy, Amy, you. Good enough courage to go live? Go live. Hey, if y'all post in that live replay group um, about wanting to go live, I mean, I'm sure there's somebody in there that would go live with you, you know? Lots of people like going live with other people. Joey, I think, is one that likes to... Um, I've seen her offer to go live with someone before. Yeah, can you make that in pen tablet? Oh, this one? Um, can you email me? I can. I, I, I will forget. I promise you I will forget. <laughs> but if you email me or message me somewhere, um, I'll write it down somewhere where I'll remember. Because I got to do my design days are Tuesdays. <sighs> one thing I can promise y'all I would do is forget. I don't have to remember to do that. <laughs> What's the name of this? This is freeform foliage. This would be a badass pen template. I'll have to redraw it and make the lines a little bit thicker. But it's definitely doable. I think it would be way too small if I just shrunk it. Maybe not. I didn't, well, yeah, I still have to. I'll make it work. Um, I think this is a very... So cool, thank you. It's prettier when you can actually see the colors. <laughs> At a distance, um, the camera kind of focuses on what it wants and makes everything dark. But up close, you can only really see the beauty of the colors. Christmas green, um, Frankenstein's castle. I think I'm sold out of Jade. Yeah, Jade was my go-to for that, but it was a custom and I got rid of it. I still need to reformulate it. Um, Frankenstein Castle would be my go-to Christmas green. Unless you want bright, flashy green, then I would go Moonseed. Oh, that was way too much purple, that's fine. If you want darker, I would go, um, um, Elemental Nature or Enchanted Forest, but they're dark greens. They're beautiful, but they are dark greens. So it depends on what kind of green you're going for. Very pretty colors. Thank you. Tell that your templates are stunning. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, so I'm gonna be a little sneaky here because 
I got this pink, but then these are actually the top of another one, so these have to be pink. But I can't affect those, which I kind of did. <laughs> Oops. BJ, hello. Oh, nope, not that. That's the wrong purple. How are you doing? Still prepping and party planning, and need to add the cups to my site. Yeah, don't be like me. I procrastinate that shit way too long. <laughs> then I get overwhelmed, and I have to take all these photos and edit all these photos and post all these photos. Then ADHD kicks in. It's like, yeah, I don't want to do this. I'm liking those colors. Thank you. I'm enjoying them myself. Jess, your message, it's a mix of that and another thing and a third. But the third is not mine. It's somebody else's. You're good. Almost the same amount of cups. <laughs> Which glitter colors are these? Um, these are... Uh, let me hold them up in two so you can screenshot them. Do not roll. Do not roll. Don't fucking try me. <laughs> Alright, this is poison berry and velvet. And then these two are castle and great bells. This one, there's nine left. The rest of these should be good as far as inventory goes. Um, and then my outline is death, which is a matte black. And I love this matte black for templates because the mattes are not nearly as static as metallics. So black magic, it's a great black if you want to like glitter a whole cup black. But with templates, this one's much easier to wipe off of your cup just because of that lack of static. <clears throat> Okay, I'm going live on Thursday to do the rose template. Ooh. Did you get that template? This one is called the Freeform Foliage. Um, and this one's from coltlitter.com. If you go to the digital section, it's in there. the cart. <laughs> so we need death. Yes. Now death I added. I bought a shit ton of death this time around because like I don't know. It's been selling out a lot lately. Black Magic has been sold out for a long time and I just put that back in stock. So I did do all the, the main colors restocked um, at some point last week and then Friday um, we got all the customs made and packed and I updated inventories on the websites kind of late on Friday. So the customs are now live again. There are, um, no, unless they've already sold, um, I'm not sure, but there are some closeout glitters remaining. There's not that many. I think there's only four colors left, um, but they're 25% off the closeouts <laughs> and you can use 10% off code on top of that. 
so those are the ones that I'm just discontinuing. Um, some of those I will be reformulating and re-releasing, but uh, right now they're just being discontinued. I'm good, how are you doing? Ooh, make the mess. It's bouncing at me. Stay on my table. <laughs> Just reading your comment, I need death. Taking any of this shit out of context, people would be so confused. <laughs> Okay. What color should the berries be? I like it. It's so pretty. Okay, I gotta go. Okay, bye. <laughs> I love the colors. Thank you. Can't wait for my order. Awesome. Did you get the um the box? Or just regular colors. I love all those colors. Thank you. So pretty. I appreciate it. I don't know what colors do the berries. I kind of want to go in with Casaloma for them, but um, maybe if I figure out my background color, it will help me figure out the berries. Because I do have little um, like dots in the background that you can't see, like these. And those have to be a color too. Small mystery box, awesome. Is that the one I packed last night? Because if so, it got picked up today. If you place the order today, I'll pack it today. It'll go out in the morning. An official contest to the group, awesome. So um, Brie, just posted in the group. If you guys are not in the Facebook group, um, it is a great resource for you guys because everybody in there is freaking amazing. Um, but there is a template that is a coffin, what do I call it? Thorn coffin and roses or something. Um, a Beetlejuice themed version of that template, which I think is gonna be freaking awesome. So we just kind of posted that idea to do a challenge in the group. So if you guys want to participate in there, the Facebook group's linked in my bio. Yellow. Uh, well, a gold. Well, what color do you see for the background? Let me figure that out and see where we're going with this. I kind of see anarchy. See, I kind of see muted and earthy. Um... Hold on, I see a Facebook join. Let me approve that real quick. Anarchy would be cool. Orchid Mist or Obsidian Plum might be cool. Orange berries, silver background. Blue or black. Anarchy, sage. Um, sage. I don't know, I really like sage, but it's being discontinued, so I kind of feel like if I use it, I'm teasing y'all. <laughs> Green berries. Silver background. Should I add, uh, oh, Joey, what about silver to tombstone? I tend to avoid silver because I consider it boring, and I need to not do that. Because whenever I use silver, I'm like, damn, I need to use this more. But then when I think about doing it, I go back to, it's boring. <laughs> I think because the cup is, is silver, you know, steel. So I'm just like, well, my job right now is to make it not steel. So why would I go silver? <laughs> Crushed opal. Well, my base is black. Ooh. Rosemary. My base is black, so crushed opal would not be crushed opal. It would be whatever color it flashes. What about the pinkish gold color? Um, deceptive nature? 
Rosemary is my new obsession. Should I use Rosemary? Amanda! Are all the Amandas in here? Are we missing one? Or two? We're missing two. The Luna is Amanda too. Rose gold. Rose gold will be pretty. See, I do have... Okay, hold on. Let me pull options out. Let me put the lids on this. Illusion. I discontinued Illusion. Um, that's one of the ones... I don't know if I'm going to bring that one back. I don't know if I'm going to reformulate that one or just discontinue it. Because that's one that I discontinued for now. I know the gemstone ones, like Amethyst, Ruby, Sapphire, Pink Sapphire. I'm going to reformulate those um, in a way that my supplier can pack them. Can mix them and pack them so I don't have to. <clears throat> and then they're coming back. Um, illusion? I don't know. Wilted. Wilted would be cool. Wilted would go with Anarchy. Which is Rosemary. Okay, so Rosemary is a chunky white iridescent, but it has like confetti pieces in it. But over black, it is phenomenal. So this is what it looks like in the jar. Um, just make it black. <laughs> so this is what rosemary looks like in the jar. But you see the purples and the pinks that are flashing? That's what you see when it's over black. So it actually has little confetti shaped pieces in it that I don't know if you can actually see. They're just like tiny little lines. But over black, oh my God, it's so pretty. Um, Wilted Cosmos. Somebody said rose gold, which is similar to these guys. Um, what was the other one? What did you say? Do it. Rosemary. So these are the other colors. Anarchy, Cornerstone, Rosia. Um, we are talking about light pink background earlier, so that is an option. And we do have these. Rosemary over black. Are we doing rosemary? Is that what we want? You will not be disappointed if I do rosemary, I promise you that. But if we do do rosemary, I need to go ahead and, um, get these berries done first. Rosemary? Alright, we're doing rosemary. <clears throat> but I do need to do the berries first. Because I don't want to risk getting the glitter stuck in the background. Where's that little... Here. Berries and wilted. Oh, that was the other one you said. Wilted. Okay. I knew I was forgetting one of my pulled anarchy and stuff out. It looks almost like a solid color, but when you look at it, it's so dimensional. I don't know if y'all could really tell. It's kind of tricky because it does look like a solid color, but it also looks dimensional. It's both. I love it. All right, so we're going to set this aside. Can I still see the order number on this? Yes. Okay, cool. Um, put these up and let's go get wilted. So Wilted Cosmos is our berry color. <clears throat> we are doing rosemary for the background, yes. Now don't let this fool you because this is not what it's gonna look like on the background. It's going to transform. Rosemary is magical. Um, you know what, I have little dots in the background, but I'm gonna weed them out with the background and do them all rose, or yeah, do it all rosemary. I'm not going to um, do them a different color. 
Or I could do them black. Nah, I'm not. I'm gonna do it all rosemary. Never mind. Candy, hello. The color in the bag, Amanda, it was the fallout from the cup, which was these four colors. Casaloma, Grave Bells, Velvet, and Poisonberry. Hmm, yeah, yes, Rosemary is beautiful. Rosemary is one that I actually discontinued um, over a year ago, probably. And then I found that I still had some, and I was consolidating the bags because I had them in two different bags, and I accidentally spilled it on my desk. And of course, my desk was black, and I saw how beautiful it was over black. That is the reason why I brought it back. <laughs> It's like witch's brew. It's fucking ugly as hell over white, but you put that bitch over black. It's phenomenal. I kind of want these berries to be black. Mm. Should I do them black or should I do them with wilted? I'm questioning myself now. Pinkish gold. Um, deceptive nature is the one that I think it is. Black would be good with the rosemary. Wilted, wilted. Anna, hello. How you doing, woman? Everybody's saying wilted. I don't know. I know I asked your opinion, but I'm not listening to it, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm going to go with black on this one. <laughs> you were not allowed to use black. <laughs> Kelsey, too bad. FaceTime me later and bitch about it because I'm putting black on here. <laughs> Oh, damn it. Did I just... Uh, I didn't pick a background piece off. That little dot went supposed to be black. That's what I get, Kelsey. She did that. She plucked my little background piece off just to spite me. She did it from Virginia. I really pulled a cast on that one. I did! <laughs> Got it straight from the Highline Handbook. <laughs> At least I felt bad about it, though. I don't think that part's from the Kelsey Handbook. <laughs> hey guys, what color? Never mind, I'm gonna use black. Yeah, you do that shit all the time. That's why when you ask my opinion on something, I'm like, girl, you're gonna do what you want anyway. <laughs> Like, you're already invested in this idea. Why are you even asking me? <laughs> I did respect the decision at first, but then I saw black. And you know how I am with black. It's just... I, I reach for it. <laughs> you do? What? You do feel guilty? <laughs> What are you saying? You do what? Ooh. Guys, we got ombres this. Hold on. Like, I know we just use all these colors in the cup, but look how pretty it would be going from black. It's an ombre on a cup. That would be beautiful. <clears throat> okay. So, now we gotta pull this background up. So we can put rosemary on here. Because I listen. And y'all said rosemary. <laughs> I 
sunny and good Milky Way? Yeah, it would be good Milky Way colors. Send all the black to our house. We'll take it one <laughs> take one for the team. Yes, I'll black everything, please and thanks. <laughs> the reason why I use so much black, like, I mean, one, I like the color, obviously, that's what started it all, but two, if everything, like, I understand liking color and vibrancy and stuff, but if you go into a room and everything is a different color, you're going to see all those different colors and all of those different things. Um, I am OCD and clutter really fucks with me. So if everything is the same color, even though you have the same amount of things in the room, it looks like less. And that's why I really go for all of my office is black and my bedroom is black. Like everything's black because it's just calming for me. I see less stuff. Look how beautiful this background is in black. It's so pretty. Background's gonna be popping. Yes, it is. Hear me out. No. <laughs> nope. As soon as I write, hear me out. I knew what was coming next. <laughs> Kelsey, do your free form. Are you going live today? Do a free form and do Matt. I'll hang out with you. I have a phone call I gotta make first, but I'll hang out with you. Makes sense to me. <laughs> Brie. But you like blue. Mint is kind of blue. Hard pass. <laughs> Literally just flopped on my bed to take a break. Well, you can unflop later. <laughs> I'm just saying, do a mint foliage. So I can tell you to use black and you can tell me to fuck off. <laughs> Y'all have no imaginations. <laughs> we have imaginations. It's just not mint. It's black. <laughs> Everybody has a color. Chandra fights for orange. Kelsey fights for mint. I fight for black. <clears throat> Chris is orange too. in here. I haven't seen Chris. Well, I haven't been live in a minute, so that's probably why I haven't seen him in a minute. Dark imaginations. Yes. Dark intrusive thoughts. I have a lot of those. <laughs> I'm definitely one of those people, like, if somebody does something stupid, like, I think it would be really funny if this, you know, spiteful, stupid thing happened. But I don't do the spiteful and stupid thing. But I definitely think about it. <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but when it comes to that spiteful shit, like, my mind goes to those dark places. But I do not like how I feel if I follow through on them. I feel like shit. And I like who I am when I don't feel like shit. So I don't do them. But I do think about them. <laughs> Maddie cement. <laughs> Hear me out for real. Oh god. Vintage mint? Are you gonna get specific on the mint? What am I hearing out? Don't you dare say fucking holographic either. Some silver holo. Silver holo with mint. Pastels. Conjure. Um, Conjure has been discontinued, ma'am. It's being replaced with a sparkly, sparklier version of the same color called Merciless. But you're right, that would be kind of pretty. Okay, where's my rosemary partner in crime? Where's Joey at? There's Joey. Yeah, I don't do spite or revenge, but intrusive thoughts, 100%. Yes. Yes. I live through my spite and revenge in my head. But I'm proud of who I am. And if I act on that spite and shit, then I'm not me. I don't feel like me and I don't like it. Um, so, light purple. Joey. Um, merciless. Ombre into rosemary. Opinion. (laughs) 
Merciless, I did. <laughs> when I made the labels for Merciless the first time. If y'all have that color, Merciless, look, check your label, because chances are it says Merciless, because I put an extra eye in there for some fucking reason. Now it's correct. Joey says yes. And then she says yes. Okay, so we'll do it. We'll do Merciless into Rosemary. Because I would compliment this really well. It'd be perfect. So, let's take Kelsey as the color queen, and I trust her. <laughs> Is Joey a puppet now? <laughs> or is she like Siri? <laughs> Kelsey over here trying to like manipulate Joey. <clears throat> Kimberly, thank you. I appreciate it. I'm loving this color palette. Kelsey over here trying to get me to add mint. Oh, Joey, did you, are you familiar with Wheeler Walker Jr.? Because there's that song I mentioned earlier in your live, and I, I couldn't tell you to play it because TikTok would ban your ass quick. But there is one song that's hilarious, and now I kind of want you to hear it. <laughs> She's pulling my strings. <laughs> the Color Queen Puppet Master. Just fuck you notice the <laughs> I love me some mint, but not with these colors. I also love me some black. Yes. I'm with you. I like any color, but it has its place. And I can find black in any place, so you know that's what I go for most of the time. Man, it's just so pretty. Okay. All right, so let me get Merciless out. Uh, so just for reference, let me show you guys. <clears throat> no, this one's discontinued, it's sold out. This is Conjure and this is Merciless. They are the same color. This one is a high sparkle metallic. This one is a regular metallic. That is the difference. So it does look like it's a little bit bolder but it's just because it's flat compared to this one. You see a lot more sparkle in this one. Um, and that's the only difference in these two. So this one's going away, this one's staying. If I, When I find the high sparkle versions of cur colors that I carry, I'm discontinuing them. So like Eclipse switched over to Final Warning, same color but high sparkle. Um, Fate of All Fools is a high sparkle one. Wilted Cosmos is replacing Exposed Flesh, same color, but Wilted is the high sparkle. So some of them, that's why I discontinued them. But that's why Conjure's going away. Merciless is what we're going for. Hear me out, Virginia Reaper. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't go for Kane. What's wrong with you, Anna? You want me sticking up to your red stuff? <laughs> you suck it. I just went to creep on Joey in that collection. I know. She's got almost all of them. Oh, she does have all of them when she gets her new order in. She'll own every single one. Gorgeous with the black background. It does. <laughs> the reds are pretty. Not on this cup. Oh, I see. I feel you. <laughs> these are phenomenal. Okay, and listen, I ordered a shit ton of these on accident. Like, my, I have one overstock box dedicated just to these reds. And it's actually overflowing into another box too. I have a shit ton because I fucked up when I ordered. So um, please buy these. They're beautiful. <laughs> They're iridescent, which usually does not cover over black. But these do actually cover over black. It looks like crushed rubies. You will not be disappointed, I swear. <laughs> so if y'all like red, those are your jam. Buy the red fools. <laughs> We got Mrs. T over here. I don't believe it was by accident. Well, it was by accident and I actually need to place another order because of my fuck up. It was supposed to be blue, but even if I didn't fuck up, I still fucked up because the blue I was supposed to order instead of the red is actually a blue that I already carried. I thought it was a new color but because I have plans for that specific blue. Um, I need to get it in soon. 
So I fucked up. Even if it didn't fuck up, I still fucked up. So ultimately, I extra fucked up. You know, I gotta fix it. <laughs> so I have a shit ton of red. The product or the project you just did. This one? The one that I'm working on? I'm going to ombre merciless into rosemary because it's freaking beautiful. Ooh, look how pretty that is. Damn, okay. If you hold on. Don't have Kane or Hell's Gates by it now, they're absolutely yeah. For real. I'll remind me in a second if I forget, because I'm really good at that. And I'll um open them and show them to you. Cause Hell's Gates, oh my god. <laughs> That's all I gotta say about it. I should have named it that. Oh my god. That's what we're calling Hell's Gates from now on. Just like bone powder, it's white as fuck white. That's what it's called. <laughs> An official name for bone powder is white as fuck white. If y'all want a white that does not shift, does not change, it just stays pure white and sparkly, bone powder. That's the one you want. This is so pretty. Go ahead and wait. What are we doing? What are you waiting for? <laughs> I have Hell's Gates and it's amazing. Yes, Sea Glass Virginia Fever had to be gorgeous back. Oh yeah. Sea Glass is iridescent based though, so it would probably shift over the black. Is it five yet? I wanna go home and play with glitter now. <laughs> Purple silver. It's like a metallic lavender. It's just a really high sparkle, so it, it does kind of look like it has silver in it, but it's just a solid purple. It's a high sparkling metallic. Alright, should I go lower or should I go straight to rosemary? Because rosemary is going to carry up a little bit. Fuck it, I'm going to rosemary. That's beautiful. What white? Bone powder. Hold on, let me grab it so you can screenshot it. <coughs> Now you do want to use this on a white base because it is a little bit transparent, but your cup will not shift. It will not do anything. It will stay white and sparkly with this glitter. <clears throat> it's not iridescent. Right into rosemary. Okay. I use bone powder over colors. Yeah, I mean, if you want to use it over colors too, but if you want the solid white, definitely use a white base. The purple in the background that I used was Merciless. Now, see, this is what I'm talking about. My label, I misspelt it. It says Mercilize. <laughs> but I fixed it. So the ones on the shelf that you should be receiving should now say Merciless like it's supposed to. <laughs> Which is a good white for over black. Uh, Lunar Cycle. The best white to go over black is Lunar Cycle. And there is a chunky version of Lunar Cycle called Pearly Gates. And because it's chunky, you can actually see the white to gold shift. It's really pretty. Amanda. <laughs> okay, so this is the magic of Rosemary, okay? It looks blue and green, but you get up there, you see that shift. It's like pink, peach, and purple over black screenshot it now because you're gonna want it <laughs> look at this make sure my thing is clean it's not showing yet okay hold on probably have to do it at a different angle let me get this thing on the cup i know it looks scary because it's like no it's white trust me i actually have this on another cup that's finished um, I'll show it to you so you can see it under epoxy. I haven't left work waiting to see this. See if I can get y'all a little bit closer too, maybe, because... 
Wait for me to brush this off before you judge it, because you got that build up, so it's going to look more white than anything. I want to get this in there. Okay. I can kind of see the colors, but hold on. See, I can see it. Hold on, wait, let me get it on camera. I can see it from here. I don't know if y'all can, though. Oh my god, it's so beautiful. Okay, you take this camera down. <clears throat> Ruby? I don't know. She might be. She was earlier, but she's working. Okay, so. Damn it, it's not showing it. I mean, it's beautiful. Oh, there you go. You can kind of see the purple in it. That flashy peach you see. Damn it. How can I angle this to where y'all can see the shift? Damn it. I can see it. <laughs> so there's the peach. It's freaking light. It shifts so hard. It does, but it's so hard to get it to... When it's moving, you can kind of see the colors better. Where can I move this cup to... That just makes it white. Hold on, y'all. Let me figure this shit out. <laughs> Damn it. Maybe if I put it under epoxy. Let me show you the other cup that I used. With this glitter that's sealed. So y'all could... Black this. This is rosemary up here. It is so pretty. But it shifts pink, peach, and purple. But again, it depends on the angle because it's, y'all know, special. <laughs> I wish I could get it to show so you don't think I'm fucking nuts. You can kind of see the purple there. But it is really pretty. It's beautiful. If I turn this light off. Oh, there we go. Better. You can see the peach. It's hitting my charger that I got hanging, but... I'm disappointed that y'all can't see it the way that I can see it, but it is really fucking pretty. Where are your cups from? I buy mine from Hogs. I'm seeing this still depot. Use it today or so it's a price. Like, what? Wait, what is this? <laughs> I saved some of the beautiful glitter I ordered from you and I love it. Oh, awesome. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. You sold me at purple. <laughs> yeah, these are all from um, um, Hogs. This one's a 22 ounce. I wish I could. I'm so disappointed that you can't see it. Even when you're seeing it well, um, it's not the same as it is in person. But this is. Um, let me try it without the light on this one. Oh, there we go. Now you can see that shift. So the bottom half is not. This is toil and trouble. But this top half, this is rosemary. This is the color that's in the background. I'm gonna put my phone back in and get my light back on. So beautiful. Thank you. The day is complete. Rosemary is a must. Gotta run. See you all later. Bye, Amanda. <laughs>
All right, but see, this is what it looks like in the jar. You can see that shift though now, look at the shift. The colors that's, that you see flashing are always going to be the colors that you see over black. So if you wanna know what an iridescent looks like over black, wait until you see that flash, that highlight, because that's what's gonna be amplified over black. But can y'all see the little shards in it? How you have chunky pieces, but you also have the little lines in there? Little confetti sized pieces? That's what really makes this one so cool. It's not like your regular chunky. <clears throat> it's a unique cut, I really like it. It's so different, it is. It is very different. Um, I have a couple jars. I have to go through my personal stash. So <clears throat> when I'm packing customs, sometimes we have jars that are not completely full. They're just like half jars of something. Um, so these jars, I'm going to be taking them like this one. There's really not much in it, but I mean, you can do a cup with it. Um, I'm going to take these and be throwing jars these half full jars into random orders so if you get a jar that's like half full and you're like what the fuck happened just know it's free okay <laughs> i'm gonna be throwing those in orders until i run out anyway and then my personal jars of the colors that i'm discontinuing i'm gonna pull those and i'm also gonna be throwing those into orders so um the half full ones they're current colors just not full jars and the ones coming from me will be discontinued colors, but a lot of them are pretty full. But they will be being thrown in orders until they run out anyway. Those little freebies. So, colors that I used today are these guys. Okay, before I do this, let me do my spin for my live replay so I can edit my video. I wish it would show the shift, but I had to epoxy it. I don't have time to do that because all of my turners are full. I'm gonna place my order in an hour. Awesome. We have code alpha active too. If you need a 10% off code, we do have that active right now. And there are some closeout glitters on the homepage. If you scroll down, um, there's a link to the closeouts. That is, um, they're 25% off and you can stack and use the code alpha on top of that too. So these are the colors for today. Um, so I will work on getting this live replay posted, um, hopefully tonight. So you guys can rewatch the live, um, it will have the template linked, it will have all the colors linked, it will have everything linked. So if you want to rewatch live videos at any point, like if you're missing me when I'm live, go to the website under the Inspire page and click on Live Replays and you can rewatch any of my lives there. And it will have the templates and supplies linked. <clears throat> you know what one I'm gonna have to make me? I have it in my photos. Ew, now I'm curious. I need to convince myself I don't need glitter and here I am. <laughs> this is a bad life to be on if you don't want to shop. <laughs> if I'm doing my job right, if I'm making my shit pretty, then this is a bad life to be on. If I'm having a bad day and I'm failing miserably and it really looks like shit, this is a great place to be if you don't want to spend money. <laughs> the blue library. Oh yeah, I still have that one. I gotta put one more coat on it. That one was pretty cool. We are the wrong group to be with then. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm going to have to get off because I've got some shit I got to do. Shopping should be good now because it'll only be refills and new releases. <laughs> yes, you have all of them. Like, that's freaking awesome. You and Debbie are the only people who have them all now. Oh, you're doing right. <laughs> I try. I try. All right, y'all.
Uh, I am going to hop off of here and clean off my desk and declutter myself. And um, if y'all need me, Instagram, the chat on the website, or email me, Chris with a K at quiltglitter.com. Um, check the top of the website for the sale. It's 10% off site wide with code alpha, but if you forget, it'll be up there and that code expires Thursday. Um, <clears throat> I think the boxes are sold out, the new release boxes, but make sure you sign up for the email because when these colors get released individually, um, it'll be announced in the email. And I do have something new and fun that I keep teasing y'all with and sorry, not sorry. <laughs> Um, I hope to have it out before the end of the month. That is my goal. And that would be also, the information will be in the emails too. So make sure you sign up for the emails and the Facebook group. It's a great resource if you need it. But um, yeah, that's all I got for y'all. So thank y'all for hanging out and I will see you again on Wednesday.